Over the past two weeks, we've introduced you to David DeYoung, the Michigan photographer behind the World War I Survivor Project. His magnificent photos of each of the last nine World War I veterans in North America were unveiled at the Pentagon a few weeks ago. They remain on display there. After an interview with our Jim Benson two weeks ago, we asked DeYoung to share some of his recollections of each of the centenarians. We'll share DeYoung's memories of each of the veterans, one at a time, in regular VA news in the coming weeks. This week, it's our old friend Lloyd Brown of Maryland. A World War I Navy veteran, Brown died one year ago at the age of 105. We talked to him at VA's 75th anniversary celebration and at a ceremony in his honor at VA Central Office. DeYoung said Brown's mailbox, with the letters of his name falling away, became the lasting metaphor for the passing of a generation. One of the most interesting photo shoots I had was visiting Lloyd Brown in Charlotte Hall, Maryland, just uh, south of D.C. here. This was taken in his home where he lived uh, for many years, obviously, and he's uh, clutching the American flag that I took to most of the shoots. It's a 48-star uh, vintage flag, and uh, he's just looking off into the light, a, a very pensive, reflective pose. Over the back of him is a portrait of him in his Navy uniform. He was the last American Navy person who served during World War I. 